Well, across the country, school districts have revisited their cell phone policy for kids inside the classroom. In South Carolina, new legislation now bans cell phones from public classrooms. WJCL 22 News' Kyra Naveau shares how educators in Liberty County plan to keep students away from their phones. The countdown to the first day of school is on, and Liberty County educators are ready to implement these new cell phone pouches for middle and high school students. You know, the fact is, is that why do we have textbooks in school? So that students have a way to be able to learn the materials. All this is, is one more tool for our students to be able to have to help them to be able to learn. This comes after school districts across the country work to limit cell phone distractions inside the classroom. But teachers are constantly po policing, you know, uh, put your phone up or you have your phone out or that kind of thing. The new yonder pouches work like this. It's within the pouch. They'll simply lock the pouch. At this point, it becomes locked. Then at the end of the day, they'll take the unlocking station, these will either be mounted on the walls or they may be in some cases on mobile stands. They'll simply touch it, unlock it, and take their device out. Students will hold on to their phones in the lock pouch throughout the day. And if they need to use the phone, they must go to the front office. Students are texting each other during the day. This is going to happen in the bathroom. Uh, did you know what somebody said to you or uh, said about you? Uh, meet on the A hall, there's going to be a fight. So, you know, this kind of thing. That's going to eliminate all of that. The pouches have been used in schools around the country, limiting classroom disruptions, allowing a raise in test scores and grades. We want our students to be able to compete when they leave here. We don't want them to be with us 12 years and leave us and can't get a job, can't go to the military, can't go to college. We're serious about educating them. In Liberty County, I'm Kyrie Naveau. WJCL 22 News. Students with medical needs must submit documents to receive a Velcro pouch rather than one that locks to access their cell phones.